This is one of three successful drop tests of NASA's next deep space exploration vehicle conducted this summer at the Langley Research Center's new $1.7 million hydro impact basin. NASA Langley held an official ribbon cutting ceremony for the new facility that expands the center's capabilities to test and certify future spacecraft for water landings. This facility has come full circle. This time, Orion, NASA's crew exploration vehicle, is the focus. The lander facility and the vast experience of its Langley staff provide a perfect combination to study the Orion multipurpose crew vehicle's options for returning to Earth. The excellent work and the contributions from the Langley team will continue now with the delivery of this unique new capability. Later this year, we will bring high fidelity MPCV crew module test articles here and we will begin drop testing them in this water basin. I look forward to these upcoming tests and uh, to our future joint successes together. Congratulations on this uh, superb new facility and thank you for everything that the team does here. At 115 feet long, 90 feet wide, and 20 feet deep, the Hydro Impact Basin holds 1 million gallons of water, allowing Langley engineers to check out the water landing properties of future spacecraft. In this case, the Orion Multipurpose Crew Vehicle, or MPCV. The new Hydro Impact Basin is located at the historic gantry where Neil Armstrong first trained to walk on the moon.